Hello, this is Dr. Sunghun Lee at uh, International Christian University. Today we are going to uh, look at uh, some sound files and see what we actually see when we open those sound files on Prat. So once we open Prat, we have a window called Prat Objects and another window called Prat Picture. For now, we are not going to use the Prat Picture window. So we open a sound file. And the way to open it is uh, press open or click open and then go to read from file. And then you go to the folder where your data is or the sound file is. And then you click the sound file and click open. So this is how we uh, are going to open the sound file. And once uh, it's opened, it's now in the proud object folder. Uh, you know, window as an object, and you can see it's a sound because it says sound. And the name of the file is prod one hyphen three English vowels, and it's uh, preceded by number one. That means, like, basically, it's uh, the first process that was done by prod. And uh, this number on the left will increase and will not have any effect on what you want to do in prod. So, how can I look at this sound file? So what you need to do is you highlight the file that you want to open. Then you go to view and edit. Nicely, it's already highlighted in blue. So you click view and edit. Then it opens. And now we see the sound file. So while we are looking at the sound file, there are multiple things that we can see. There are two panels in the uh, Prat sound file view. The top part is the waveform panel, and the bottom part is where you can see analyses. And uh, at the moment, it says to see the analysis, zoom into at most 10 seconds, or raise the longest analysis setting with show analysis in the view menu. So. If you look at, uh, so how do you know how long a sound file is? What you can see is um, there are three lines in the bottom of this tab pan two panels. The uh, bottom one is total duration and it's 15 seconds or like longer than 15 seconds. So what you can see is longer than 10 seconds. And that's why we are do, uh, why we are not being able to see the analyses. Let's uh, uh, try to zoom in and zoom out uh, the sound file. And if you go to the lower left, you can see zoom in and zoom out. Uh, and clicking in will uh, allow you to zoom in to the more detailed view. And now the visible part is 1.9. So we already uh, see multiple other things in this view. We can also zoom out yeah, by clicking out repeatedly. Let's say you want to see uh, just the fifth uh, vowel or fifth word. What you can do is you click uh, and then drag to the right. Then it's selected, highlighted. And you can play too by clicking Bad. The, sound, uh, the duration. And then you can click to selection, zoom to selection. So this uh, uh, now zoom to selection, it shows like a selected view, uh, a zoomed in view into the fifth recording. You can also go back by using uh, the button BAK. Let's uh, zoom in a little bit. And then let's say you want to see all sound files again, then you can click all. Basically, this is uh, what you can do once you open uh, the sound file and what you can do. So at the moment, uh, you know how to select a sound file by click and dragging. You know how to do zoom in and zoom out, zoom to selection, and also one operation back by back. And you know what the meaning of all is. Uh, you also know that now the, uh, the bottom part is total duration, then the duration of the visible part and duration of the selected part. So this is uh, the basic view of Prat once you open a sound file.